I have a message for you. Have you been seeing repeated numbers? And the angel numbers you've been seeing, let me give you an example, 555, 999. And you're like, what are you trying to tell me? Well, 555 is bringing about deep changes, massive changes. Are you putting in the work and the effort to allow the changes to come in? Are you making changes in your life? Or what about 999? Are you avoiding an ending? Do you continue to have to learn and little by little suffer and hold on because you're avoiding an ending because you're afraid of what you'll go through and this suffering is familiar? I say that and the angel numbers because the message I'm getting is about you continue you are continuously being communicated with and for the sake of or let me this or I'll do it here I'll wait till then or I'll no you're gonna keep accruing this and you're gonna keep seeing those damn angel numbers until you choose you because why do we avoid changes? Why do we avoid endings? We're worried about other people. Mainly, if you get to the root of it, oh, well, I'm accustomed to this suffering, really? And that's not good because you don't have to suffer continuously. Yes, things happen and they occur and they bring about suffering, but you do have a choice in how long you continuously give something energy to create more suffering. You do have a choice to heal and make things better. And you're avoiding an ending that's gonna bring about great changes and you're fucking up your alignment. So it's time to let things go. And it's time for you to choose you and start moving forward into becoming the best version of you. I also feel like you need to pay attention to um, your reactions towards things. Like, like I've said, you know, uh, there's a su our subconscious runs 90% of our days, right? It's not easy to always be consciously aware. But pay attention to why you're reacting a certain way or if you really care or if it's because someone told you you're supposed to care about certain things and make sure it works for you.